Hello, how are you doing today? I hope you are good. Today I'm starting something a little new on my YouTube channel. I'm starting a new occasional series that I'm calling Mouse Music because I am mouse and I am learning music. So this is going to be a little series about my experiences of, you know, learning music as an adult. And maybe it's something you'd be interested in if you are interested in learning an instrument or you're interested in learning music theory or music production because I am I'm working on all three of them. I started last month, so it's early days, but I want to start this series as soon as possible so I can keep track of my progress. I'm not starting completely from scratch. I have a little bit of prior knowledge. Like a fair amount of people, I imagine, I learnt a musical instrument as a child. At the age of around 9, 10, 11, I had keyboard lessons. I went to a music shop every Saturday, I think, for about an hour and had keyboard lessons. When I went to secondary school at the age of 11, the lessons stopped. And my school said I could get lessons for free there, so my parents were like, well, that seems a lot better. But for some reason, I never got the lessons. When I was a child, I was very quiet and I did not like speaking to people. I am not called mouse for nothing. Still not a big fan of it nowadays. I prefer talking to people when they look like a camera lens. Anyway, I suspect I probably had to sign up for the classes or maybe they were group classes, either of which would have sent me running in the opposite direction, so it was probably that. So I just kind of stopped and then many years passed. In my 20s I kind of lost interest in music a little bit, I kind of lost my music mojo. I've made a couple of attempts over the years to kind of get back into music. I decided I wanted to make music for my YouTube videos, so I kind of delved into music production and you know all my videos now have music from that time in them, but I kind of reached a plateau. I reached a point at which um, I couldn't progress anymore by just clicking random buttons until a noise that I liked happened. So that kind of petered out. So I've been using the same music in my videos for a very long time now, and I'm not entirely happy with it, so I'd like to make some new stuff. But yeah, cut to a few years ago, 2017 I want to say, I got really into K-pop, and suddenly music is a big part of my life again. I'm listening to music again all the time, I have favourite artists, I buy albums, I know when new things are being released, and my music mojo gradually returns. So thank you to K-pop for bringing music back into my life in a big way. Because now I'm not just listening to K-pop as well, lots of genres, and you know, rediscovering a love of groups that I used to like when I was younger. So now is the time. I have picked up the keyboard again, and I'm gonna learn and improve. Here is the keyboard in question, the one that I was learning on when I was 10, and the one that I am learning on now. It is a Yamaha PSR3 if you are interested. It does have a stand, but I can't find it. It's quite a large thing to have managed to lose. I would like to get like a full-size keyboard at some point, but at the moment we're working with what we have, and then I'm learning music theory at the same time. I have a Skillshare membership, which is kind of a site that has lots of courses in different things. I've been using it for videos and stuff. But now I'm going to use it for music, so I've been doing some music theory courses, and I never really knew anything about music theory when I was learning the keyboard originally, um, and I've been finding it really, really interesting. And I'm learning to read sheet music as well, so I'm sort of doing those things all at the same time, and then we'll delve into music production a bit later on. And this is going to be like my little music corner, it's just a bureau at the moment, but maybe in a few months I'll have my laptop up here, maybe a little MIDI controller, a couple of studio monitors, my keyboard in front of me here, on the stand that will be found. So that's kind of the main priority right now, but I have one other thing that I'm looking into. Speaking of working with what you have, my dad played the guitar, he passed away a few years ago, um, but he had a bunch of random music things. Um, which I now have. Unfortunately, I don't have his acoustic guitars. I've never been able to comfortably play a full-size guitar. I have my own three-quarter size guitar, which is much better for me, but I do have his electric guitar, but I'm hoping at some point to learn the guitar, but we'll worry about that later. And then when my mum and I were sorting through his stuff, there was a fair amount of random music things, um, so we put them all in this box. So one of the things I am looking forward to doing as part of mouse music is figuring out how to use all this stuff. So we've got a bunch of cables, we've got a tuner, we've got a distortion pedal, there's a microphone, pretty sure I know what those do. There's this thing which doesn't currently have any batteries in it, but I really want to get this to work. There are these things, I don't entirely know what these are, so if anybody knows, please feel free to let me know. And then there's this drum machine, which I would love to make use of. So that's pretty much it really. Now you kind of know what I'm hoping to do with this series. Let me know if there's anything in particular you'd like me to make videos about as part of this. Let me know if you have any experiences of, you know, learning music 
stuff, any tips for me as I delve into the world. I'm really enjoying it so far, it's very early days but I am uh, pleased with uh, the progression I have made, and yeah, we'll see how it goes, I guess. I don't know how often I'm gonna make these videos, it's not gonna be super regular, you know, like weekly or something. It'll probably be every once in a while when, you know, either something exciting happens or I make a breakthrough. I'm excited, it's gonna be fun, and I'm looking forward to taking you along with me. And if, you know, you were, like me, interested in music when you were younger, but life happened, maybe this is your sign to pick it up again as well. Thank you so much for watching this video, and let's move across to the end screen. If you'd like to see my latest video or some more mouse music videos when they exist, then you can do that below me here, and if you'd like to subscribe to my channel or visit my website, then you can do that beside me here. And there's also a link to my Patreon page in the description below if you fancy it. Take care, stay safe and well, and I will see you very soon.